the next three videos are all related to Qatar and the World Cup. They brought it in their own ways. Uh, right now, to uh, touch on the f- fact that Qatar has decided to ban alcohols within the stadium. Um, apparently, it was going to be allowed up until few uh, up until today or yesterday when they said that they wouldn't be selling it any longer, which is bizarre to me. Uh, why they would be selling in the first place, but anyhow, this is good news for Muslim countries sticking to Muslim principles. However, one thing I don't understand is uh, why are they still selling it to people who've bought like two thousand pounds or whatever packages or tickets. So then, basically, if you're not an average fan, you're someone who's in a box or in a private box or something. You're allowed to buy alcohol. Otherwise, it won't be sale on sale to normal fans. So they, I don't know what their stance is on alcohol sale, um, within the stadiums because they're giving mixed messages. Uh, but also to the fans complaining about alcohol. First of all, can they go without alcohol for a few hours? And secondly, many stadiums throughout many European countries do not sell alcohol within stadiums. So what? Why haven't you been saying anything about that? You're only speaking now.